This is Betsy Sharkey, film critic for the Los Angeles Times, and my critic's pick this week is a twofer, Coriolanus, and we need to talk about Kevin. These are two excellent dramas that dropped in briefly in December, just long enough to qualify for Oscar consideration, and now they're back in theaters for their full run. Coriolanus is Rafe Fine's contemporary take on Shakespeare's treatise on war, politics, egos, and economics. These eyes are not the same I wore in Rome. The sorrow that delivers us thus changed makes you think so. Best of my flesh, forgive my tyranny, but do not say for that, forgive our Romans. Fine is turning out to be as superb a director as he is an actor. He does both in this film, and he surrounded himself with a terrific cast that includes Vanessa Redgrave, Jessica Chastain, we Gerard like. Butler, and a really exceptional Brian Cox. These are big themes that are being tackled here. The action is bold and brash. It's a kind of compelling story and something of a size that really should be seen on the big screen. On the other hand, there's We Need to Talk About Kevin, which is Shakespearean in its tragedy. It's an intimate story, a family drama, and it stars Tilda Swinton, one of the finest working actresses in the field today, and is an Ezra Miller, an up-and-comer who is really worth watching. It's a story of a family torn asunder by a troubled son. I was concerned that you might be feeling responsible. Was that? Because you were supposed to be looking after her. We just don't want you to blame yourself. No, I, I don't. I mean, I, I never said I did. She's going to need a glass eye, Kevin. So we would appreciate you looking out for her and any name calling. You don't really remember being a kid much, do you, Dad? See, he's just going to have to suck it up. Oh, you didn't like those. Yeah, well, they're, uh, they're, what do you call it? An acquired case. And I will not kid you, it is searing in its Stop sadness. This is difficult watching, but the performances are extraordinary and the story is compelling. And frankly, there are some times you just need to let a film break your heart. Hey, Kev. Listen, buddy, it's easy to misunderstand something when you hear it out of context. Why would I not know the context? I am the context. 